struggle. We all go through it uh, several times throughout our lives. I know I do. But every time I go through the process of struggling with something, I always remember the story that a shaman told me years ago. According to that story, there was a man who found an emperor moth and uh, took it home to watch to watch it emerge out of its cocoon. But as it happens, uh, there was a very little hole in that cocoon and uh, it seemed that uh, the moth was really struggling very hard to get out of it, to, to really manage to get its body out of the cocoon. The man was looking at this for hours now and he felt bad, he felt he felt uh, he should do something to help this poor moth that was trapped inside that cocoon, that evil cocoon that was uh, holding it back from freedom. So what he did was he took a pair of scissors and created a bigger hole in that cocoon and immediately the moth emerged out of the cocoon but of course, its body was all swollen, its wings were shriveled up, and he couldn't do anything but just lay there and die a slow and potentially painful death. You see, the quote-unquote merciful snip that this guy provided for the cocoon, for the moth, was not at all merciful because that kind of struggle that the uh, moth was going through was nature's way of forcing fluids into its wings, making this creature, the creature that it was supposed to be, came into this world to be, this beautiful butterfly. And uh, so, therefore, all I had to say about this, of course it's obvious, struggle. Sometimes is all we need in order to find ourselves, in order to be able to uh, ascend from situation A to situation B, in order to be able to find our magic, in order to be able to realize how strong how capable and how powerful we really are. So that's it.